Mexicans, Mexicans are definitely the first not to be scared to use pink for paint. The pink church or the temp, Templo La Avang, Avangaleka. See, there, there are problems. They're definitely using a lot of security. I'll still go to the hospital. I think that's a good idea for the evening. And I think I think a big big influence is just to focus on family, having stronger families. They really relish, really have found ways to get enjoyment more out of family than trying to acquire things. And it, the family support units can definitely be encouraged with. Oh, I don't know if it's just for seniors. Either that, or they just run out to a lot of the young people, so you got more middle age. You got some big buildings, big support for child care, central clinic, La Fee Clinic, and then there's one over here Child and Adolescent Wellness Center. They might put more effort in, uh, different, they might put a different kind of effort into child welfare. Than, than Europeans. All right, it's just after 9 p.m. and I wake up with a sore, with a with a sick feeling stomach. It's empty. I did not eat anything before laying down, and I wake up with a sick feeling stomach. It just makes no sense. Right, it's another typical breakfast. I eat and my stomach gets sick. So I got the magnet pack. I'm just gonna wear permanently over my stomach. I gotta put it right over my stomach. I had a fruit cocktail and peanuts. Just a tiny bit of the last of my yogurt. That's it. And I get sick after eating that. And also I'll say my, I think my, my prostate is in pretty bad shape. That almost seems to be affecting, <laughs> it's probably a multi-organ cancer. All right, so there's a higher overlook than this. This is kind of interesting. I'm just wondering if there's a drop off somewhere. <clears throat> hard to tell. It's got a road that gets closer to the edge. Oh man, my stomach, it's, it feels like it's on fire after having consumed just a multi, a multi chunky fruit in the, out of the can and peanuts. My stomach's on fire. What do they do? A car smash here? They really, they really beat. Well, it's mostly the windows. <clears throat> Left all kinds of garbage in there and painted it. Whatever. Al Exe. So high school over there. Oh man. It's like, it's kind of affecting my breathing, this, this stomach illness. Well, this is a pretty neat overlook itself, besides the, the one marked on the map. <laughs> Bunch of garbage. very trashed house over here maybe some kind of a fire and then the collapse at a cross yeah this used to be something Not sure how deep this hole runs uh, the curb is holding out <clears throat> So this is a part of the historic district. 
and they fenced it off. It's it's uh, got bars on the windows here at this house or whatever it's called. Apartments. Still got the kitchen. Still got the kitchen stove. You can walk right on the property. <laughs> Had a basement. Yeah, is there any? Can't really, really see. Yeah, they've they've nailed the door shut. People come through and just smashed all the all the windows. They had some unique yard here. They put a wall up and then the yard down here. I'm guessing maybe three doors. May, it might be three apartments. Yeah, and then they, they boarded up the, the door pretty good here. Smashed below. Looks like you can walk behind it too. It's a nice plant. Oh man, I feel so sick. And it's like making me kind of lightheaded too. Okay, I go walk up to that smashed area too. What is this part of the basement? Seeing the. Wow, yeah, some kids maybe gone through and just smashed walls. This is all an entirely stone structure. What the heck? Okay, and then there's like maybe a garage below, some lower building, and then spray paints. Yeah, these kids are really messing this place up. They didn't care. It's a nice spot. Sort of overlooks the city, <clears throat> but it's been largely abandoned. It's just because of age, I guess. This would be a nice spot to live. Just across from that, you got these nice stairs. What does it lead up to, I wonder? I overlooked below. They even had a middle rail. Doesn't look like much anymore. What was this? A foundation for a house? And, uh... <laughs> Maybe a driveway here. I think some flooding has caused enough erosion to change the landscape. You know what, the air feels great. I think I'm just in bad, bad shape now. They had a fence for this one crumpled house. And I left my bicycle behind, but I think it's pretty safe. Because <clears throat> this one here is okay, it's got a no trespassing sign. This would maybe be the driveway. <sighs> they put up this fence that they just stopped uh, maintaining, stopped closing and locking. They got more fence in case they needed to replace. I'm guessing maybe the fence was put up uh, when the house was still standing. And then when it burned down, they were like, Dios mio. Yeah. Was this knocked down on purpose? Spray paint. <laughs> so some kids have gotten here. Looks like it was a nice thick house. Could expect a long life. But yeah, it's a lot of brick structures just can't handle big fires. And whatever was over there, it looks like an older, even older cement building that's falling apart. If Mexicans don't mind using peach and pink more because they can't blush 
Whereas, see, this is like a peachish. Whereas Europeans, we blush and are more pink and peach. So we kind of avoid those colors because they remind us too much of our own skin. Poochie. Oh. Quite a unique neighborhood here. I think I'll go to the library. Just look around. This is a one-way road. A two-lane, one-way road. You gotta watch for them. It can be confusing at times. <clears throat> I let these weeds grow nearly to the roof all along for whatever building this is an apartment looks like a, some kind of apartment So the house or the road is in a like a river channel. Oh, these are lower though. They built the houses up a little higher for possible floods. Some of them. It's really a neat. It's a neat setup. It's very unique. Octavia and Rio Grande. Well, it seems like uh, having loosened uh, the gear for the chain so it's not so tight, having a looser chain is the, is the solution. So far, it looks that way. It's pretty neat. I think this is a church. Kelly Memorial Food Pantry. I've been looking for them. Hmm. Wednesday and Friday and Saturday, yesterday. Dang it. Just north of the library, not far. North of downtown. Sunday morning, things are nice and quiet. I could probably ride through the streets downtown wherever and enjoy the peace. <clears throat> Wyburn Roderick Hall. People are coming here on an early Sunday morning. Okay, there's a sign talking about this, this church. I'm sure it's very interesting. They've always been so interesting. Looks like the doors are open, but they got glass doors. <clears throat> we got glass doors here. It's a pretty good church. Ride the Paz. Pretty good sized church. Where am I? Camp Hill? Got a, a black guy standing in the center of the intersection. Oh, it, it kind of looks like he's begging, but I don't know. They like to hang out on the streets a lot. Really risk takers. Real risk takers. Looks like they're gay friendly here at this apartment. It's very active on this highway on a Sunday morning. Gosh, it feels so good that my bicycle isn't creaking so much. My stomach ache is kind of going down, but I wonder if it's because of the magnets. I got them right on the site. But I am a little lost. I guess I could wander around without looking at the map. I want to look at the map so bad. Yeah, the streets are very relaxed. Whoops. <laughs> That's a nice bump. I don't know what this guy's doing, but he's got the right of way. <clears throat> Go through this park. Oh, it's got a history to it. 
there's a lot of people who usually walk through here. Huh. Fascinating. Taft, that's early 1900s. Historic sidewalk clock clock. Where's that? Yeah, I don't I don't really oh right here. Okay, 1911 All right, they're working on this old building It's kind of looks like it's got a long way to go for revitalizing and it probably fell to the wayside during the housing market crisis housing market crisis probably stopped a lot of uh, re rehabilitation oh wow Mars Maricela and Amanda huh. So I don't think you can access this statue over here. It's a lot of old stuff. That was a security guard. Ron White. April 4th is... Wait, it's March. Okay. So they got a security guard here. I don't know what he's... He's reading a movie poster. He's, he's got a lot to patrol. But he doesn't seem like he needs to protect much. I don't see any bums anywhere. Not anywhere downtown. Alright, coming up on uh, some familiar stuff. Yeah. That's a stadium, and this is... This really looks like a Frank Lloyd Wright design. Can I, yeah, I can kind of get in there. I'll take a closer look at this. Get right up to it. This is a Frank Lloyd Wright inspired design. Because it really feels like things are climbable. El Paso Live. <clears throat> Stop, no alcohol beyond this point. Why, what's... Oh, jeez, I just skipped a gear. That's been starting to happen. I think I really broke something by having the chain too tight. This is the baseball stadium. If I skip gears like that at the wrong time, I could... I could crash. I really messed it up with tightening the gears. No alcohol beyond this point. I don't see, believe? Oh, uh, here's our first bum. Just hanging out. This is kind of a hangout. All right, train station, I guess. Oh, there's a sign, gotta read it. This is, wow, they're letting the, the uh, weeds grow. This isn't really used for anything. There's an old sign here, Baton Memorial Trainway. So it used to be a trainway. This is looking south towards the Mexican border. And this is used to be a more popular train way. 
It's not like it's trashy. People don't leave trash laying around. It was upgraded for wheelchairs. What's that say? Something about Rocket Buster Boots Showroom Warehouse. Rocket Buster? Wow, what's this? An old train station? This is kind of neat. Big old tower. Oh, Union Passenger Station. It's an old train station. And yeah, I could look right through the windows. It's probably still in use. Yeah, it's a big old train station in there. Let's see if it's. Oh, yeah. Doors are unlocked. Monday through Fre Sunday, so 9.15. It's not 9.15 yet. You can hang out. <clears throat> All right, I guess I'll head back. This property uses video that puts you under surveillance.